Hey Aries, it's your honest homegirl K Shanique, and this is your homegirl horoscope. So let's see what energies you are dealing with. Okay, so some of my Aries, you guys, you guys are pregnant. Your back is hurting. Okay, you you don't have time for games, or you could be dealing with a female that is pregnant at this time, and they could be complaining about their back hurting, or this could be you, Aries. For some of you, it could you're pregnant by a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, water sign, male here, okay? They wanted this pregnancy, and you over here like, this is torture, this is pain. I got to go through this change. Or they could be saying, listen, I want another baby. Can we have another baby? Please, let's have another baby. And you over here like, bruh. I got to go through these bodily changes. I got to go through these emotional changes. I got to go through these transformations. Do you understand that this is traumatizing? I don't think you get it. Just because you just is quick to bust a nut. But to have to carry this child for nine months, to have to go through all the emotional roller coasters, I, I don't think so. Some of you, you are thinking about being pregnant or when you were pregnant and you're like it wasn't pleasant baby uh no i don't want to go through that again and they are trying to get you and convince you because they want about four kids if you don't have four kids already or they want a family of four if you don't have a family of four yet or you want a family of four um some of you may take this leap of faith, okay? You, some of you may have the courage to take on what this this divine masculine wants from you. And, and you're doing it because you love them, okay? Or they may want another child and you're doing this with them because you love them type of energy here, okay? I really feel like for some of you guys, you want a family of your own if you don't have one yet. Or you could be dealing with someone that already has four kids or has children already, but you don't have any of your own. And you're taking a leap of faith of stepping up and saying, okay, if I have a baby with this person, I'm going to be not just the father to my kid with this person, but the kids that she previously had or he had um, before you came along. It's like blended families here for some of you Aries here. Okay, you may have a blended family or you're about to have a blended family. Is there anything else for Aries? Aries, for some of you guys, you're passionate about like being family oriented. Like you want something to last forever. Like you want to have all the family gatherings at your house. You, It's like you may portray like you not a family man or a family woman, but low key, like you want... A big family you want togetherness you want family sunday dinners every sunday like you want to be around your family but for some odd reason it's like you're distant or you're hiding that this is what you truly want is to have your family come together again but there needs to be some type of change here there's some healing that needs to occur and it's like you may have Excuse me, like a mother ancestor that has crossed over that's tired of seeing the family not together. And she may be nudging you and pushing you to do that, to change your ways. And maybe you cut everybody off. Who knows? So there we go. Y'all good for cutting people the fuck off and <laughs> ghosting people. So maybe your mother, grandmother, somebody's nudging you to be more passionate about being connected to family. For others of you, it's not meant to be. Some of you may be pushing something to happen and spirit is like, uh-uh. By the winter time, you're going to let that shit go. And your spirit saying something ain't meant to be with somebody. Yeah, protect yourself because the reason why you probably even thinking the way you're thinking is due to somebody doing candle magic, manipulating your energy. Or you could be doing this to somebody. And they could have daddy issues. And this is why they doing candle magic on you. It's not going to fall through. But I feel like the fall, the spring, and the winter time. 
all the seasons, I feel like there's a need for you to just protect your energy. Be careful, especially if you sat there and was like, no, I would never again. I already have kids with this person. I'll never have a child with them again. And all of a sudden, it's like you madly in love with this person. You can't stop thinking about this person. All this, this person just always on your mind. And you was trying to get rid of this person. Type, and all of a sudden, it's like, yeah, be careful with somebody doing magic and messing with your your um your willpower here. Press. Press. Fast. Pray. And meditate, okay? 